So listen, I don't have a problem with Bobby Lashley beating Drew McIntyre. I think I, I, I've been wondering why Lashley hasn't been the champion for like a year now when he was the most pushed guy and they just didn't do anything with the guy. I am I am surprised and I absolutely would not have had that match open the show and then the hero gets defeated in the first match back in front of fans. I think that's madness. Do another match first. Have Cesaro go over in the opener. Give these people something in that first match. But with that said, The Miz, do you remember when The Miz won the WWE title? Do you remember this? He won the, mm-hmm. the title from Drew McIntyre. And I had to listen to all these blokes go, first they went, ah, oh, well, we'll see how it plays out. You know, we, we, we always know how that goes. It, it played out, he lost the title a week later. But then there was always, remember that, uh, that whole, well, we need a transitional champion. We got to get this 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 belt on Lashley, but you know they you know clearly they didn't want to beat Drew, so we needed that transitional champion. Remember that argument? Well, now that we know where it went, which was that Bobby Lashley beat Drew at WrestleMania, there was zero point zero for the Miz beating Drew McIntyre to win the WWE title. Because at the end of the day, if Lashley's going to be the champion, why didn't Drew just hold that title through WrestleMania and then Bobby Lashley beats Drew McIntyre and wins the title from him at WrestleMania? He beat the bro at WrestleMania. Furthermore, if if like Lashley's going to be your champion, does it not make more sense that Lashley wins the title from Drew McIntyre than from The Miz? Mm-hmm. Not to mention, Drew lost the title to The Miz. If it would have been, you know, the Miz, you know, Miz screws Drew, and then Lashley beats Miz, and then we go to WrestleMania, and then Drew wins the title back from Lashley, you could argue, okay, well, this it all made sense in the end, blah, 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 blah. They didn't do that. They went to WrestleMania, and Lashley just beat him. So putting Miz in there, it didn't help the Miz, because he's back to being a geek. It didn't help Drew, because he lost to the Miz. And it didn't help Lashley because Lashley beat The Miz to win the title and not Drew. So there was zero reason for Miz to win the title. I pointed this out yesterday. I said, man, look at uh, look at these, all these people that said, let's see how it plays out. Let's, well, here's how it played out. You know what they said? Nice. Well, it played out in Miz having a big match at Mania. Brian. Bro, Miz was going to have that big match at Mania in January. He did not have to win the title to have a match with Bad Bunny at WrestleMania. If he never would have become the champion, he was still having the match with Bad Bunny at WrestleMania. Zero reason you devalued the title. It hurt Drew. It didn't help Lashley. And it didn't help Miz. No point. None. Yes? Oh, I... I Thought you were going to take that all the way up to the break, but uh, well, we're going to the break right argument. now, actually, because I just realized I know, we dropped. Flaw in your argument. We'll talk about it afterwards. There's no flaw. Back in a moment, Observer Live. If you enjoy these videos for just seven dollars and ninety nine cents per month, you can enjoy full length editions of the Brian and Vinny Show, Wrestling Observer Live, Figure Four Daily with Tom Lawler and Lance Storm, plus hundreds of archived shows, all in beautiful HD. Don't miss out. Join us today.